In this video, we are going to learn how to use uh, how to draw root locus plot. As you can see, we use an example for that. Uh, I read uh, the example in a process shown in this figure. We need to analyze the behavior of the process. To do that, we are recommended to use root locus plot. We are going to use lab view to draw a root locus plot. Okay. Uh, the transfer function, if you can see it, maybe now you can see it better. The, this is the transfer function of our process. Um, in this example, um, we use two methods to draw the transfer. Uh, actually, yeah, exactly. We use two methods. First, to build our transfer function. Then, we draw uh, the root locus. You can read the hints here. I don't repeat them again. Okay. 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 And close it. Control design. Control design. I fix it here. Uh, model construction. Model construction. I'll go there. I need this CD construct transfer function model. The first, uh, actually, the first way is using this VI. We also need another VI to actually to build our equation in order to see our equation. Okay, that's it. Uh, what else? I, okay, first let me wire these two. Then, um, yeah, view tools palette. Okay, transfer function equation. To see our equation, we needed indicator. I show you. This is yeah. This is. Our equation will be shown here, but we need an input for this uh, vi. We need to define numerator of our transfer function, and also we need to define our denominator. That's it. We are done. First, we build our transfer function. Oh, sorry. Then, Okay, first we build our transfer function. Okay, the denominator should be this. What happens to this tool palette? Okay. Okay. Uh, one is four is power five. Eleven four I think thirty nine. Forty six. Or 
3.624. The numerator is 1 to 4. One thing I have to say, the k here doesn't, in, uh, doesn't influence our root locus plot. If you want to know it, you can read uh, any book, any automatic control book like Ogata or any other reference that uh, you know. Okay, I put it there. Let's see what will be. Okay, you see I made, I made a mistake. The transfer function I gave uh, our program is not correct. The reason is that I that I made a mistake in giving the input of this. In fact, let me write here the coefficients. Why I cannot move it? Okay. I want to move it. Okay. The fact is, let me write it. This is in fact a shot. s power 0 this is the coefficient for s power 1 sorry that I can't write in a proper way this is s power 2 let's say these are the coefficient uh, the order of the coefficient is like that then I have to in fact here write 4 and here I have to write 1 the same thing applies also for the denominator. Uh, actually, the order is increasing from left to right. It means uh, here it should be 24, here 1, here 1. And the rest is great. Okay. Still, I made a mistake in denominator. Uh, denominator. The order of denominator is five. But okay, the numerator is correct. Denominator. Denominator is wrong. Okay, this should. In fact, I should add. Okay, I should uh, I should uh, yeah, actually you have to shift everything one Now everything is right. 11.439, 40, uh, 43.6, 24, yeah, everything is fine. Okay, now we need just to draw the transfer function from here, dynamic characteristics, CD, 
root locus. Okay, I need just wire it from yeah, just be careful from what I wired it to to the CD root uh, CD root locus. I don't know why it's stupid. Okay, root locus graph create indicator. I draw it from this function. I actually I drew my wire from this function to root locus graph. you why I did that graph palette so we can okay okay this is our graph uh, root locus graph one thing I want to okay let me start it one thing I want to see is Okay, it doesn't matter. Anyway, if I want to zoom, I can zoom and you can see that this graph is very similar to what it should be based on our reference graph. Yeah, you see exactly. Then I actually I do something so we can uh, align this. Line with line with line with okay, I think nine line with. Okay, I think now is better. Let me see. Um, maybe if I zoom here, or maybe yeah, a little bit. I think it is better. You see exactly like what it should be. Okay, this is the first way. I. Actually, I make a pause here, then I continue with the second day.